everyone, welcome back. All right, another haul, makeup revolution. On my lips. Ah, uh, the rock, fixin. Lipstick. It's Pink Wednesday. Got to wear pink. Yep, pink shirt on. I do have a topper over this, but we'll get to that. Kind of kept the makeup mellow because I want to play with some highlighters we got in here. Okay, first things first. Makeup Revolution Midnight Unicorn. Just has black packaging here. Let me get rid of the little... I hate these. Useless. This is gorgeous. I got this all from Tam Beauty, where I order from the UK or England. I don't know what you're supposed to call it anymore, but I guess it's the UK. But I just got the order in yesterday. So I grabbed whatever pictures I could. And there is the Midnight Unicorn. I, I was blown away when I opened this. I was just like, wow. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay, of course I got a bunch of palettes. Because if I'm going to place an overseas order, I'm not just getting, you know, two things. The new Mint Chocolate palette. From I Heart Makeup London. This has the little two-sided thingy too. This is a beautiful fall palette. Between the greens, the reds, the bronzes. This is gorgeous. I'm pretty sure I cannot find like, you know how they dupe everything? I'm going to do that video next. I think this is just their own palette because I have not found anything online about what it dupes or anything like that. So this, we will keep, you know, going here. Rose gold. I'm a rose gold, gold girl. I love rose gold. So this is I Heart Makeup Chocolate Rose Gold. Let me get rid of that one too. Any guesses on what it dupes? Huda. It dupes that one, and I think I've heard it might dupe uh, Modern Renaissance. Hold on, hold on. I don't own the Huda palette because I refuse to pay $65 for a palette. And plus, I'm you know me, I don't like putting my fingers into the palette. And on that Huda palette, I know across the top you have to kind of use your fingers to... Get the shadow and not my thing. Okay. Um. I wouldn't, you know, it's not a dupe for modern. At least not in my eyes, it's not. But it could be for the Huda. I'm not sure. This is AB, ah, ABH Modern Renaissance. And the I Heart Makeup. And both beautiful palettes, obviously. I mean, I don't, I'm not going to go buy the Huda palette to see if it dupes it, just to return it. But th this is beautiful, too. I mean, the shades are gorgeous. I did use a couple of the shades on my eyes. Let's see. I'll zoom in. I just went real light with the makeup, like I said. Um, on the lid, I put this shade. I am really shiny. And then I just blended out the crease with these two. Just, I, I mean, I didn't go heavy. I went really, really, wow, I am shiny as crazy. I just went really light-handed. Because I'm hoping today, I don't, you know, not up for putting on a total full face. All I have on is some BB cream. Okay, stacking them up over here. Okay, I'm gonna have a mess going. Okay, then um, Makeup Revolution did a collab with, I believe it's Sophie Does Nails. So it's called Soph X and then Makeup Revolution. So this is the highlighter palette. Here, gorgeousness. And then she also did a eyeshadow palette with them. This is the Ultra Eyeshadows, and there are 24 shadows in this palette. This is beautiful, too. These are some really great fall palettes. 
And you have a nice mix of shades running through here. Very nice. I can't wait to play with everything. Oh my. Okay. Get these. I don't want these to fall over on me. Uh, highlighters. This one is Dragon's Heart. Beautiful. These are really loose in here for some reason. I mean, but you can probably, you can't really depot them. Um, baked products. It's a nightmare doing baked products to do them. Then we have Mermaid's Heart. Which is this one here. I know I got a little dent in it right there. It was kind of hitting the top of the inside of the box. But beautiful nonetheless. And this gorgeous baby right here, <clears throat> excuse me, this is a new strobe highlighter called Lunar, L-U-N-A-R. And it is a fabulous lilac, as you can see. So we have that one. Then another, it's like a miniature palette. This is the Peach and Glow. This is a dupe for the Too Faced one. I love that they do basically Too Faced, Urban Decay, and other palettes through there. This is gorgeous. Really, really pretty. And you can see this has like three shades. And then this has the one. And there's another one here. This one's called Bronze and Shimmer. There's some more gorgeousness. I gotta swatch these. I haven't touched these yet. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <clears throat> I mean, you really never have to buy high-end makeup again. Ever. I'm going to do the peach one, because why not? We're here. I'm just going to run my finger through all three. See, so the lighter side and that side. Oh my. Wow. <clears throat> okay. Now the one I wanted to play with, of course, is the lilac. Okay. I'm going to use a, uh, what is this? My Eve Pearl fan brush. My Algenist Splash setting spray. I want to just give the brush a little blast. Let's see what we get here. Oh! <laughs> oh my! Oh. Okay. Wow. Wow. I want to do the peach one on the other side. Let me work the brush. That is crazy. Oh my God. Wow, oh my, I'm gonna be living in that. That'll make a killer eyeshadow too. I'm just clearing off the brush again. Let's go into this peach one. I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm just gonna wet the brush. And it's just a quick spritz. All I'm doing is it's not like it's soaked or anything like that. Let's just... Oh. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> I'm going to knock a little off because it's... um. Wow. All right. Round two. Back into the deeper side. Oh, yeah. Oh, my. Okay, I'm going to go back into the light side. 
I'm so glad my husband knows I walk around with different makeup bottles. This is beautiful. Bam! <laughs> I still can't believe this is going on over here. Oh my. Me, oh my. Okay, sorry, I just got totally distracted of blinding myself. What are I doing with my glasses? Help! Oh, they're on my head, probably. I'm always good for that. <laughs> Anybody else do that? Glasses are on your head, and you're like, where are my glasses? As I have like 12 pairs all over the house. Okay. <laughs> wow, I'm blown away by that highlight. Uh, I also picked up two of the ret new Retro Lux. This is the Holographic Lip Kit. And this is in Unicorn Dream. So I, I played with these last night. So it has a purple liner. And then like a topper. Where it's iridescent. This looks like the Kevin Aquan. The Kevin Aquan is more pigmented. I did put this over the Lorac, but I used a lip brush, obviously. Let me show you. You can see I used it <laughs> last night. Um, we're going to do this. The lip pencils are nice and creamy. Okay, so there is the lip liner alone. And this has like a pink shift to it. Swirl here. You can see, you might be able to pick up the pink on there. Uh, let's see if we can. It gives it an iridescence. It's beautiful, beautiful over that liner though. So this one is called the Unicorn Dream. And there's all different kinds of sets of these. But you know, unicorn, gotta get the unicorn. And then this is the Retro Lux Metallic. There's the other one. So we got unicorny, yeah, unicorn dream, <laughs> and metallic. And this one for you. I played with this last night too. This is really nice. I like this set. Okay, I'll do the same thing. I'll just draw on the lip liner for you. It glides right on. So that's like a deeper purple, as you can see. And then over the top of that, so now it has the top on it. So it gives you the shine. Wow, incredible. So those are the two lip kits that I tried. There's another palette. What do I do with it? Wait a minute. Let me see what I left in the box. What do I do with the other palette? I left it upstairs. My bad. There's one more, but we'll show you. I had two of the shadows in it break, so I was cleaning it out. That's probably why I left it upstairs. No big deal. I mean, I don't mind. It was a black shadow. I don't care that it broke. <clears throat> and the other one was like a really deep purple. No big deal. Like I said, I'm not going to send stuff back to, you know, the UK. Not a big deal. Not a big deal at all. Okay. Two more. Pearl lights. These are loose highlighters. So we have Candy Glow and Peach Champagne. Now, my only problem with these is I have to find another container. Because right, you peel off the little sticker here, and that's just a shaker. So, you know, if you shake it into the lid, oh, how am I going to do this? That's why I don't like loose eyeliners. Oh, how can I do this? I'm just going to, well, I think I got some still on the top of the lid here. Okay. I mean, these are mind blowing as well. And finely milled, very, very smooth. 
So I'm definitely gonna have to find a different way to use this because it's just gonna get all inside the cap and be all messy. But this is gorgeous. I'll probably have to get like a bigger mason jar. Then I'll just pour it all in there so I can dip the brush in and then kind of tap the brush around the outside of the jar so I don't lose, you know, all the pigment. And then we have candy glow. This is beautiful too. Oh my. I gotta peel the little sticky back again. Okay. Hold on. I hope I can get a dot out on my arm here. That should be a plenty. Oh, where'd it go? I don't have enough. Hold on. Okay. It's right there. So it's more of a bronzy glow. Beautiful though. Hey, so I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not much for loose highlighters. I never have been. Or loose pigments, anything like that. Just because it's extremely, extremely messy. And that's eh, enough stuff to clean up. <laughs> okay, so there are some swatches for you. These highlighters are mind-blowing. Uh, Makeup Revolution. Don't forget, you can find it in Ulta. I don't know when the new stuff will hit there. Sometimes it's been pretty quick. I mean, when I placed the order, and then I went on Ulta, some of it was already at Ulta. But I wanted the other stuff that wasn't there yet. So I'd rather wait for the shipping to come in from the UK and then get more stuff. And of course, they launched a bunch of new stuff this morning. So I'm like laughing as fast as I get an order in. They dropped a whole new line again on me. Ah, unbelievable. Okay, so that was the latest Makeup Revolution haul. I will definitely show you the other palette that I have upstairs. And now I'm going to pull all the chocolate bar palettes and show you which palettes dupe what. All right. Everyone have a fabulous day. I'll see you all soon. Bye.